What's up YouTube, DDBK videos. I make military content, put it on the internet for you. If you want, my social media links are in the description down below. Uh, I was streaming on my gaming channel last night. Shout out to the dudes who came through to that channel. If you guys want to follow me, it's LDWK. I'll be doing live streams on there all the time. If you want to ask questions live, get your answers read live, I'll be there. Also, I want the subscriber count on that account to hit 1K so I can, uh, you know, be a, a successful... <laughs> anyway, today we're going over top five military YouTubers underrated version. Now, everyone's going to be coming. Oh, but where's Nava? Where's Nava? But this is the underrated rated version and by no means do I mean to belittle or be like oh these are small youtubers there's not small like they have pretty much the same amount of followers I do however I just want to get them known to you guys uh, I don't even think one single person from this is a Navy youtuber However, they are military YouTubers, so I thought I'd introduce them to my Navy audience. I do ask that you guys go check them out. Link's down in the description down below. Go comment on one of their videos and be like, DWK Videos is worthless. No one loves him. Should have been left uh, unadopted as a kid. <clears throat> Let's get into it. So number five, Edward Cardosa, Marine Corps veteran. Special to my heart because you guys know I'm a corpsman with the Marines, and I just want to put a silver bullet in him. But he does fitness, uh, he's doing the whole Fuego thing with Nava. I actually did a Fuego subs review, it's totally authentic. <clears throat> he's sitting around 3.8K. He now lives in California, we haven't done a video together, uh, maybe in the future, who knows, really. Coming in at number four is Sheeny. It is an Air Force veteran, she's currently doing nursing school, or at least she's been accepted in a nursing school. I'm not aware as if she's actually started her first day. But if you are looking to be in the healthcare field or just want help with enrolling in school, this might be the channel for you. It's cool because you guys know I'm pre-nursing and I'm a corpsman in the Navy, which is the best medical profession across all branches. So I don't know if she was a med tech, but not enough. <clears throat> but being a nurse, you know, you'll, you'll pass corpsman. But if you were med tech in the Air Force, not enough. She's sitting in at 143 subscribers, so if you guys comment on her videos, I'm sure she'll be able to read them, give you guys one-on-one -on -one attention. As you guys know, with bigger YouTubers, like comments just get lost, and I don't even get notified when I get comments. Like, I'll read through videos, like I'll just click on one of my videos, and I'll see like 20 to 30 comments I didn't even get a notification for, to be honest. Number three, Lolita. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It's an army motor, tuh. Uh, she makes army videos. She also has Rose Eats, which is like a channel where she's doing food reviews and stuff like that. She does cooking barracks tutorials. I actually stole that idea of the um, less lower IQ something cooking show I made where I did one episode. I actually stole that from her because I saw her episodes. I'm like, that looks fun. She's over 10K right now. So one of the bigger YouTubers, however, given exposure to the Navy side, if you guys are interested, any of my followers, you don't have to go Navy if you're interested in Army. This might be a resource for you. Number two, Casey Melvin. You guys saw me do a video with her when I traveled to DC for one of those awards. There's a video on my channel, video on her channel. Only collab I've done with an Air Force YouTuber so far. She just got commissioned as an officer, so she's the only one on this list that isn't enlisted. She is a commissioned officer officially in the Air Force. As you guys know, officers make more than enlisted. I always talk about it when they're like, oh, should I go enlisted or officer? I'm like, well, is your school gonna be paid for? And like, do you have the means of living? Me growing up, family, not a lot of means of living and going officer would have been impossible because my GPA was like a two flat. However, if you guys are interested in officer, hit up her channel, find out what it takes. I know Air Force has different programs than Navy, but <clears throat> at least you can get the ball ro rolling and then seeing if that lifestyle is for you. Coming in at number one, it's Amy Lynn. She's currently active duty Air Force. I'm pretty sure she's around the LA area, if I'm not mistaken. She does vlogs, beauty routine, stuff like that. Sometimes she talks about military. She's sitting around 7K right now on the come up, probably gonna hit 10K anytime. However, I just wanna let you guys get exposure to her before she does hit that 10K mark. Hope you guys like some of the YouTubers I've mentioned. I highly recommend checking them out. I will make a video about top five military YouTubers, the guys you probably expect to be on a list. This was the underrated version and there's nothing wrong with that. I don't mean that in any derogatory way, but if someone's about to be like, where's Nava? <sighs> I'll make a top five military YouTubers. That's definitely not gonna unironically just end with me in the number one seat regardless of who has more subs than me or success or hands handsomeness but I'll see you guys I'm about to go live stream on my gaming channel right now so depending on when you're watching this you guys can click on the LDWK and I'll see you